bo ba do bo ba do bo 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 ba do bo ba do bo 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 A population of organisms may seem like an easy concept, but how do you know what is an interbreeding group of individuals? Once you determine a population and the appropriate scale to look at, the distribution can be clumped, uniform, or random. The distribution could reflect characteristics of the organism's natural history or underlying environmental characteristics that impact the organism. One reason for knowing how a population is distributed and moves is when you look at how to conserve species from going extinct. How do you know how much habitat it needs? Which population represents sinks in the metapopulation, where you don't have to worry if they are impacted, and which represents sources? meaning that without them, you might cause local extinction, called extirpation, and then you would miss them dearly.